lovelies welcome back to my channel my name is tia aka teacup simmer and this is another part of our wolf quest series and we are back with zephyr who has just woken up from a very long nap he spent a lot of his time hunting the other day so he is just kind of resting near this boulder trying to take stock of all his injuries he's still a little bit um hurt from earlier but his health is a lot better now he is not as nearly as bad as he was when he finished um, going against that um, cow elk and the baby so right now he's just been resting we're pretty much gonna wake him up and see if he wants to go eat he's a little bit hungry I'm pretty sure the carcass should still be right here I didn't see any major predators come by I don't remember where I put it is it over here where did it go or did it run away did someone eat it that's a possibility there's mule deer around here but I'm pretty sure our carcass should still be here. If it's not, I'm going to be upset because that may be a thing and maybe a thing where carcasses and things don't survive after you've eaten for after it's been like a day or so. I don't I don't know. It's a possibility or it could be that I'm completely dull and I missed it and I don't know where I left it. That's a possibility. Um, who are you? Is that a bunny? It's a bunny. Zephyr, go get it. Get the bunny. Yay! Look at him. He got a bunny. Ah! And you, as you guys know, in a lot of our, if you guys don't know anything about Zephyr and our elements packs, I'll leave links in the description box and in the card in the top right corner. Do you guys want to have any information about um, how Zephyr <laughs> is as a character and has a creature? We're going to have him just eat this bunny for a hot second. Bye bye, bunny. But um, Zephyr is definitely a very distractible, curious, fast, and um, kind of um, carefree character. Um, he's not necessarily like his brother Merlin who is um, very much go with the flow. Zephyr is like likes to take action, likes to do things, but he tends to just kind of go for stuff that he thinks he just goes to do things that are interesting. He doesn't particularly mind much what it is. So he like gets distracted by bunnies. He's super sweet. I love him to pieces. But right now he's still a little bit hungry. He's still a little bit tired. Um, but it's to be expected. He's he's had a he's had a rough couple of a rough couple of days. Um, considering that that <laughs> that hunt took a lot out of him, which I'm not surprised by. He's not strong like his older brother, and he's not very strategic like his um, sister. So it's not going to be easy for him to kind of take on the um, the ability to kind of strategize and be the brawn for every situation. Now that he's on his own, he may or may not be good at. Um, once he finds a mate, he may need someone around. And there's lots of individuals that are like that, that prefer being social than anything else. And he, I think he's kind of like that. I think we're in a different territory we are. Ooh. So I really want to turn around. I want to go north east, I think. This is why it's hard for me to tell. Let's see, which direction do we need to go? We need to go this way. You're such a cute baby. Look at you. Look at you. Stop peeing on everything. We are in Stranger World territory. We probably shouldn't pee on other people's things. My mother told me that's a bad idea. What? No, run away. I didn't realize there were Stranger Wolves. <laughs> I'm so sorry. We're sorry we peed on your territory. <laughs> we didn't mean it. So I was just like, I, I'm so sorry. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't understand. My bad. And at first they were very growly. So hopefully, did they leave us alone? They left us alone. So we need to go northeast so we can stick to stick to the territory that is kind of unoccupied. We're not really looking for any dispersals at the moment. I don't think he's looking for anyone else. I think he's just exploring. Um, stranger territories, I think he would try and avoid, but he does like other individuals. So it, it could be a toss up. Like he could just be like, hey, I want to hang out with you. Are you okay with hanging out? Are you or you want, do you want to be friends? Do you want to be friends? And I think that's, that's the idea I get from him. He's very much like, do you want to be friends? I want to be friends. Let's see. Let's check scent view. Let's see what's over here. That's mule deer. Um, that's some elk. 
he's a little hungry and he's tired too and he doesn't have nearly as much stamina as he used to um he also has never been one for stamina so he may um especially once we get the pack stats back and like the statistics on each individual wolf having more or less of a thing like um potentially having um, him being faster or stronger or having his mate be faster or stronger like that once we start getting into that type of um move i think it'll be easier to tell because he's going to be he's more fast he's he's a little bit more strong but he has horrible stamina um it's just something that he's known for um so if we can get him um basically into running matches or like hurting he's just really good with that um but he doesn't do well when it comes to like head on um going against one um oops too many obstacles Let's see, elk herds, elk herds, they're all coming from over here. We're in stranger wolf territory, so this is a problem, but that's the bull elk herd. Stranger wolves, there they are. I don't see any stranger wolves, but they're definitely, there's definitely the herd. Um, and there's the bull elk, so they're really close by. Um, so we're gonna try and let's check the map for a second. We are full on in. So we kinda wanna push them. I don't know if we can. They're kind of moving whatever way they wanna move at the moment. I'm gonna see if we can kind of push them that way. Oh, at least so that they don't go farther into Stranger World territory. And those are the mule deer. Mule deer are actually kinda cool. Um, let's have, let's see. That's a bull. Moose hunt. I don't want to. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight a moose. Moose is just gonna kill me. I'm never gonna, like that. Is the thing that's not going to happen. We are not going to go after any moose. That is just not gonna be a thing. Let's see. You're not. What are you? Can we? Let's speed up. What are you? You're a cow elk, but you're pretty weak actually. I can kind of kind of see let's see let's see if we can go after her there we go we're taking a little bit of damage but hopefully we can kind of oops she's she did a lot of damage there I don't know how well but we may just end up going for a calf uh, especially if she's gonna do so much damage when we try and attack her um, let's see Nope, run away. Too many, too many trees, I can't see. Let's see, did they move? They moved. There we go. I'm trying to see if I can find a Babu. Let's see, let's lock onto you. Who are you? You're not, you're too healthy. Let's see, you. You're not too healthy. Oh, dang it, stranger wolves. And they definitely want to fight. Golly. Come on, let's go. He's very much like, I don't like you. And we're very like, we're sorry. This is our bad. Didn't mean it. Didn't mean it. We just really, really wanted something to eat. Ugh. Since we're in their territory, yeah, we have to just keep going out because they're gonna, they're gonna give us, a, they're gonna give us some trouble. So Zephyr, you are getting into a lot of trouble. You are not making any friends, my love. Just no friends at all. So he's probably gonna book it. Like we're not gonna go after a bull elk, especially not with how how we're alone at the moment. I don't think there's anything else. Um, hopefully the stranger wolves aren't gonna come after us again. Um, we're still moving in the right direction. So let's see if we can follow this herd. The fescue herd. 
Let's see if we can follow them and see if um, we can get anything out of that. Because at the moment, there's female dispersals around there. So they may be hunting the herd. That's possible. So we may be able to pick off maybe like a carcass or something. Um, if they've taken something down already. Oh, there's a carcass. So they may be eating. Let's see, is that? That's mule deer. So there's mule deer and... Um, a few different, there's a few different scents on this. So we've got mule deer and elk cow carcass. So we can probably deduce that the females have taken down an elk and so they're holding onto a carcass. Um, we don't really want to fight them for that because um, there's probably more, more than two of them and we don't really want to get into any like arguments over, over food at the moment. Cause there's no need there's love and peace love and peace everyone let's see yeah we're gonna see if we can i forget that we can't jump over things there's a creek hopefully we'll get there before everyone starts moving massively okay so the elk are around here somewhere we just saw the tracks so hopefully we'll be able to find the herd fairly quickly without having too many problems. Um, I haven't seen too many glitches in the game um, since, let's see, are they over here? They may be. Yeah, I haven't seen too many glitches in the game um, since I've been playing. Other than like the occasional stutter, we're not really getting too much of anything. And we're in, we're in territory again. Ah, this is a problem. I don't see anyone, but I really want to get a carcass or at least some hunting done. This is a moose. No, we don't want to deal with the moose. Um, there's a fox. Elk herd. This is the reed grass herd. So the fugue the feud herd we missed. We must have missed them somewhere. Who are you? Oh, you're a moose. Bye. I don't wanna I don't wanna deal with you. Yeah, we missed the feud herd. I don't know where they went, but we don't wanna stay in the Junction Butte Pax area because they're gonna cause they're gonna cause us some problems. Zephyr, you are not catching any breaks, are you, darling? Let's see. We're still... Um, let's go... Let's see. We're going northeast. Let's go this way. Because we want to see if we can get into some friendly territory with possibly a herd. That's, that's the goal. We want to find a herd in some friendly territory we don't have to worry too much about it but he is getting super tired we may end up having to take down like a mule deer or something because he's hungry well he's getting hungrier he's just super tired at the moment um let's see we're working our way through the pack territory we're on the edges so hopefully they don't get too upset um but he's still he's still hanging in there my poor zephyr baby I just love the way this this thing looks. Like, look at it. Look at how pretty it is. Zephyr, look at how pretty you are. You're just so gorgeous. You're just so gorgeous. Let's see. We're gonna go this way. I always have to remember how the the mouse wheel works in this game because it, it can cause me problems. There's a carcass. It's coming from that way, I think. Yeah, it's right over there. Let's see if we can do it. Is there? We're we're not in territory anymore. Which which pack? Which which elk herd is this? Yes, the rice grass rice grass herd. So we're not going there. So that's pretty much in the. I think it's Butte territory, the Butte pack territory. Yeah. So we're not we're not going over there because they have already shown themselves to be very grouchy. 
Very, very grouchy. Like these cliffs give me anxiety. Like because he can, he can, you can fall off. Guys, like look at this. <laughs> he can fall off. Like look at that. That's ridiculous. He's like, I'm sensing, I'm sensing danger. We're gonna try to go down this way. But yeah, you could fall off these things and it not even be a thing. Like these are so huge cliffs. Like I love the detail and I love what they did with it. But they went crazy with these cliffs, man. Like, look, look at that. Look at how crazy that is. Like, it looks amazing. He's just like, he's like a, just a wolfie. An amazing wolfie. Look this way. Look this way. There we go. And then shift P is our photo version. So he can look amazing. He just looks so cool. I love it. Okay. I'm done. I promise. I just... Ooh, the river. We can go to the hang... We can hang out over the river. But I really want to go... I want to find our way down without hurting ourselves. Because that is a possibility of hurting ourselves. You can fall in this game, guys. You can fall and hurt yourself. So let's avoid that as much as possible. Um, I really don't want to have to, like end of this game because he decided to fall off a cliff like that's that's just not how I want to end this series he has so many things to do and he's so adorable beautiful and like amazing that he needs to he needs to create amazing puppies and we need to name them so yeah we're not having Zephyr fall off a cliff let's see is there anything around here we're trying to see if we can find a little bit of food or we may end up just having to basically just shack up in like a small area. We might curl up next to one of these rocks and just take our time. Um, some of these episodes aren't going to be as eventful. We may not. And that's the funny part with the way the game is set up now. We may not actually come to a point where we get um, a lot of episodes where we end up hunting because of how the game works now because the game is set up so that if an individual needs to hunt or if um, the wolf needs to hunt the meter will show it <gasps> bunny get it yeah and I, I I knew we were gonna I knew this was gonna happen he was going to be the Lord of the bunnies because he just he's just so cute and he he absolutely adore and it's a funny part I think his favorite food is bunny because it's super easy and less stressful than trying to hunt down um trying to hunt down an elk of some kind he, like he just does not like it but I think this is where we're going to end this part right here you guys Zephyr needs to get some sleep he is not he's been running around avoiding stranger wolf packs all day he's an adorable babe I, I love him to pieces, um, but I love how the peeing starts before, <laughs> I love how the peeing starts before he can, he does anything, it's kind of weird, um, but it's a beautiful day, he needs to take a rest, um, because he's still a little bit hungry, we may, and he's still hurt a little bit by trying to hunt in a stranger wolf territory, he's having a hard time, he, without his siblings on his own, he is having a hard time of it you guys because right now Zephyr is always been like easily running in running out just getting like a few bites in and then of course Tara with his brawn would just take everything out with just a little bit of extra help and now he has to do all the work himself and it's just it's just not working for him it looks like it's gonna rain it looks like he's going to be super tired so we're gonna leave this part right here thank you guys so much for watching if you're enjoying this series please leave a like please subscribe if you haven't already and please hit a notification bell so you guys can know when i post another episode about zephyr and his amazingly adorableness um i hope you guys enjoyed the video leave comments down below with ideas for how his strategy to change what he should be doing to make sure that he can take care of himself a little bit better but thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!